Hey guys, Courtney with The Flipping Nomad here and we are starting a super special super. new project here and I am joined with a very special guest. This is Janine Pettit, camper in chief of the powerhouse <laughs> girl camper organization. Girl camper. Girl. With the ultimate girl camper here. Yeah. <laughs> and we know there's no wrong way to camp like a girl. So if you're in the ultimate Montana or a little tiny teardrop, I mean, we're out there having fun, right? We are absolutely having fun. We have our annual Girl Camper Charity Trailer. This is our fourth year, fourth annual Girl Camper Charity Raffle Trailer. This year it's a sweepstakes, so every single state can participate this year. We have got a Keystone Springdale, and guess who is putting her spin on it? We are, as the flipping nomad. I'm just the grunt work here. I'm gonna be sawing and papering and pasting, but the design, it's all you, girl. So our keystone here is going to be raffled for the Girl Camper Charity Hold You Foundation. This is a foundation that helps parents whose children are in critical medical crisis. The winner is gonna be chosen on Valentine's Day, just like every year. And we're gonna sell lots of tickets. We are gonna sell lots of and tickets. And help lots of parents. And it's gonna be awesome. And what we're super excited about is to kind of kick this Springdale up to the next notch. Keystone has given us a wonderful foundation to start right. on, but we're gonna kind of kick it up. Factory to fabulous. Factory to fabulous. Well, Janine, here it is. Here is the refreshed little 2022 Springdale 1750 RD. And we had so much fun taking it from factory to fabulous. And Keystone laid such a great groundwork for us to be able to build off of. So you'll see this beautiful black cabinetry in here and the brass hardware, that was from the factory. I couldn't believe it. When I walked into this cute little thing, I was like, okay, well, my work here is done. Um, but of course there's still room to infuse some personal design touches and really make it your own. And so that's what we did over here. Um, on this bathroom wall, we went with a really fun floral wallpaper and then more of a bold color down towards the bottom. We had a lot of fun with the bed too because we wanted to focus more on simple things that were cost effective that would really make a difference uh, within the feel of the interior. And so we went with this fun array of pillows here. And as you can see above the headboard, there's this beautiful black accent wall. Again, that is from the factory with Keystone. They've done such a good job with their interior designs for 2022. Um, and you'll see up here, there's a shelf again here from the factory from Keystone. Uh, but we just added these beautiful white baskets from M Design. And what I love so much about M Design is they focus on functionality but they also pay really close attention to design. So not only are these baskets functional, but they're also very beautiful. One of the really cool things that we got to do with this project was pick any floor plan that we wanted. And one of the reasons we honed in on this particular one, which is a 1750 RD, is because of the configuration and you have the big rear windows at the back and the bathroom up front, but then you have a fully separate bath right here in the middle. And this is a really good sized bathroom for such a compact RV. And we did a few little upgrades in here too. So we swapped out the kitchen faucet and went with more of a brass. Um, and um, I, I think it looks super cute against the natural wood countertop and the white sink that was already here from the factory. And then we also upgraded the shower head. So we went with an oxygenic shower head and it, uh, the way the shower head is built is it kind of helps um, give uh, better water pressure, I guess you'd call it, without using any additional water. So it's a great way to add in some functionality and a little bit of design. We gave the kitchen a few upgrades as well. And one thing we wanted to focus on was increasing its functionality because with such a petite little rig, we don't have a ton of, of kitchen space. So what we did up here was used some of the awesome, awesome components from M Design. So we gave um, the winner another little shelf right here, but since we didn't permanently affix these, they can move them around however they need to. And same thing with this little set of drawers right here. We essentially gave them triple the amount of storage 
Another little upgrade we did from a design standpoint is this peel and stick tile backsplash. And to look at it, it kind of looks like real tile, but it's just peel and stick. This peel and stick tile backsplash is a great way to go. And the main reason that we chose this 1750 RD was because of this rear dinette. So this big window back here is the back wall. So imagine being able to take this little guy off the grid, back it up to a lake, open that rear window, and you basically have a three-sided 180 degree picture window back here. It's incredible. You'll see with this dinette back here that we got to update the cushions um, to a little bit of a different fabric. And that was thanks to our friends over at Lippert Components. They jumped in and, and recovered these cushions for them. And we can't say thank you enough to them for that. This floor plan um, also turns into a bed back here. So this table folds down. So if you ever wanted to take friends or family members camping with you, they have their own dedicated space back here. And also speaking of taking this little camper off the grid, we have to give a, the biggest thank you to Dragonfly Energy, who is the maker of the Battleborn battery. They provided a 100 amp hour lithium battery for this RV and its retail value is about $1,000. And so that will allow the winner of this RV to be able to camp in confidence knowing that they will be able to use their 12 volt system. Also, this little camper came with the SolarFlex 200 package, and that is part of the SolarFlex uh, integration that Keystone is doing throughout all of their brands. So all of the RVs, uh, with the exception of the destination trailers, are coming out of the Keystone factory with solar, which is the coolest thing. Well, Janine, we had so much fun taking this little guy from factory to fabulous, and I know we have a bunch of friends watching this video at home. So if somebody wants to get a ticket for it, how can they enter the sweepstakes? Here we are friends, inside our Springdale, which has been beautifully styled and designed by our good friend, Courtney Armstrong at the Flippin' Nomad. She put her signature style on this. We gave her free reign and who wouldn't? Nobody styles an RV like Courtney does. We are so thrilled that she came in and made this happen for this year's Girl Camper Sweepstakes. Let me show you some of the things that this has. Courtney added some extra storage down here. And of course, underneath the cushions, we have storage as well. Back here, a big drop-in space that you can put those things, like your winter coat, things you don't use all the time, but you wanna have access to without having to go outside. I want to show off our buffet <laughs> so even when you're camping you've got to serve food we have a decent counter space here but you can make all the dinner put it right up here everybody can help themselves and serve themselves this is pretty deep storage in here so this would hold lots of pots and pans your cast iron for camping um, there's plenty of room over here for dishes so extra clothing i mean Lots of storage in there. Uh, there is a bracket that is behind this beautiful wallpaper where you could mount a television right there. All the things are ready to go right there. All of the things that I'm showing off right here, the coffee station, the light here, all of the dishes on this beautiful table, whoever wins this RV gets to keep everything. So it's coming fully loaded. Here we are up front, and this is a full queen size bed. This bed is so comfortable right here. This of course opens up on a set of struts and you've got storage underneath your mattress. It has a front window up there, so you can get some ventilation at night and it really feels like a little private sleeping space. This wainscoting here is just half inch she installed this this is all on her website so go and look at how she did this it's absolutely beautiful the wallpaper is from spoonflower she used that as her jump off with the high impact black cabinets and the gold hardware everywhere i think she made a beautiful statement in this rv thank you friends for touring our fourth annual girl camper charity sweepstakes rv and we're thanking our friends at Keystone for helping us get this off the ground. 
Our dear friend Courtney Armstrong from the Flippin' Nomad did an exquisite job taking this from factory to fabulous. If you would like to buy a ticket, head over to girlcamper.com. It is so easy to purchase. A little pop-up will come and you won't have to be searching around for it. $10 will get you 10 tickets. But if you want to spend $100, you'll get 150 tickets. If you share it, they'll give you one free ticket. We also have some extra prizes happening this year. Our friends at Campco are donating their great new outdoor refrigerator. Outdoorsy's got an $800 gift card. Lippert has a $500 gift card to get you some nice chairs and stuff. Go Power is uh, providing us with a portable solar system so you could hook it up up front there. We also have an airlift suspension system. And lastly, Buzz eBikes is donated a $1,000 folding eBike. I had the fun of trying that out last weekend. Thing folds down like this, weighs 35 pounds, goes in the back of your truck and goes 40 miles an hour. It was so much fun. So if you don't win the RV, you have all kinds of chance at other prizes. The drawing is going to be February 17th. Now the raffle ends on February 14th, like always but our platform that we're using will not be allowed to pull the winning ticket until February 17th because they have to wait and see if anything came in the mail. So it ends on February 14th. The winner will be announced on February 17th. Spread the love and help families in need. This is Janine Pettit for Girl Camper Keystone and all of our partners. We thank you for joining us in this endeavor.